are doing a swimathon. Um, it's not only a swimathon, but there's going to be different activities in the Dixon Center gym. There's going to be raffle baskets, speakers, vendors, all different kinds of things. Um, we're doing it in honor of my boyfriend that passed away this past summer of a drug overdose. Um, we're also going to be honoring the boy lacrosse player that um, passed away last year of a drug overdose. We picked out a nonprofit. Um, the nonprofit is Bridge to Recovery. It's a nonprofit that um, helps addicts after rehab get back on their feet because um, when they first come out of rehab, they're, they lost everything. So basically, it's for them to um, get into a recovery house and get back on their feet. So their um, chances of overdosing actually decrease. How the day is going to play out is you don't have to swim. Um, you can come to the event. There's going to be um, a lot of raffle baskets and activities going on in the Dixon Center gym. Um, there will be uh, raffle baskets from signed flyers gear to a mini iPad to um, a Keurig, a Polaroid camera. There's going to be a lot of um, big raffle baskets. So there's going to be a lot of speakers there. One in particular is the district attorney from Delaware County. Um, there's going to be a lot of kid-oriented things like dance-offs and um, face painting. There's going to be a moon bounce. It's going to be um, fun for all ages. And there's also going to be vendors, um, family support vendors, people from this area, um, rehabs, counseling. So all the lacrosse players, the boys lacrosse players will be there. Um, so if you guys just want to come out and support our cause and our event, it'll be awesome.